All right, real quick, these things are rated for up to 24 volts. These are automotive style USB charger outlets and also reads volts. And so what I did is I hooked up one of these to my old Renergy 12 volt mono 100 watt solar panel. And I'm using one that has an actual PD charger on there. And it's reading flickety flickety 19.3 volts. And I've got this wire hooked up to my phone and it is super fast charging. And then this wire, it's a USB 3.0, is charging the Motion 600 Soundcore Bluetooth speaker. Pretty freaking cool. Old solar panel. This thing's probably, I don't know, 10, 11 years old. I just had it sitting there in the corner. I said, what the hell? I'm sitting out here getting some sun, charging up the phone, charging up the boom box right here. Pretty damn slick. Just direct. I just made a MC4 pigtails onto the solar panel. 16 gauge, you know, zip cord. And put some terminal ends on this guy right here. And that's it. No fuse, nothing. Just rock and roll. You can turn it off right here. A little button turns it off. Simple as that. It took me five minutes to make that cord. Plug that in and bammo. And the reason why I did that is because I was testing out this X Dragon 20 watt, which has USB on there, and it was on slow charging, even in direct sun. This thing's about junk. Thankfully, I didn't pay a lot of money for it, like 20 bucks on sale, like 75% off, and that's probably why. So I'd like to get a bigger one of these, you know, at least a 50 or 60 watt one so I can get fast charging. So there you have it. Thanks for watching. Stuff I come up with here in the back here. It's like 82 degrees out right now in February. It's nuts. All right, later.